Hey guys, it's Erin here. Today we are undertaking quite a task and we're going to organize the closet behind me. Why is there so much stuff? There's a lot going on. No girl should ever have this many swimsuits. <laughs> what do I even do with this? Can you even see me? Last time I organized my closet was when I was transitioning from warm weather to cold weather items. And now we're gonna do the exact opposite. Cold weather, back to warm weather. So let me show you what we're working with. Every time I open up my closet, it gives me a little bit of anxiety because I know how stuffed up and chaotic it is right now. I personally think that if you have a clean space, you'll have a clean mind. So that is the basis of why I'm organizing today. So the Marie Kondo method is to take everything out of your closet so you can see what you're working with. Here we go. So these are all of my long sleeve tops. Oh gosh, so much stuff. The way Mary Kondo says is to look at a piece and see if it sparks joy in you. This is a perfect example of something that I don't ever wear. It was super cute when I got it but probably only worn it once since then. Unfortunately, I'm gonna have to say goodbye to this. So I'm gonna make two piles of rejects. One pile is going to be for giving to Goodwill, and the other pile is going to be what I sell on Poshmark, which I will get into that in a little bit. Keeping this, keeping this. I'm not really sure about this one. It's really hard to be picky because I do like it, I just don't wear it a lot. This denim jacket, I think, can carry on pretty well to the spring because it's pretty light and it's good for layering if it does get a little bit cold. I'm gonna go ahead and put this in my storage pile. Since I don't really need warm layers like this anymore, it's just gonna go on the top of my closet and gonna stay there until the next season. This is so insane. I am in disbelief over how many pieces of clothing that I actually own. So much so that my piles have started to blend together. One of the reasons why I'm always so stressed out about my closet is because of all this stuff just here on the floor and I just wanna take care of that. So before we start to organize, I'm gonna continue taking everything out. So since we are spring cleaning and getting ready for the warmer weather ahead of us, I am going to put away all of my winter items like my chunky scarves and my heavy jackets. And those are gonna go into these storage boxes that originally my warm weather clothes were in. So now I'm just sorting each item and putting them back into my closet. I'm going to work on folding everything very neatly and organizing them onto these shelves right here. I'm going through each of the drawers and emptying them out, only keeping the things that I wear and then I've been folding them up and putting them back into my drawers. So I've done my socks and my bras so far and I also did my jean shorts. No girl should ever have this many swimsuits. It's just not necessary. And the funny thing is, this isn't even my entire swimsuit collection. I have all of my active swimsuits in my closet, and then I have 
two bins full of swimsuits that I sell on my online store. So as you can see, this is getting a little out of hand in terms of quantity. So I'm gonna dump this out. And I'm gonna go through all the suits that I actually wear and want to keep. Everything else I will list on my online store. So now I'm gonna list all of these items onto my Poshmark account. And if you guys didn't know, Poshmark is the easiest way to sell your clothing in an app. You can sell clothing, makeup, stationery, home goods, bedding. What I love most about this app is that Poshmark handles the whole shipping aspect for you. So when you sell an item, you get an email with your shipping label. So you just print that out and you stick it on to any of those free priority mail envelopes at your local post office and you drop it off and you're good to go. I have been using Poshmark since 2014 and I'm looking at my Posh stats right now and it looks like I've made $6,325 off of 405 sales. So not bad for just listing your unwanted items online. So I just open up Poshmark, I click on sell, and then I take a few photos of the item. So now I just put a title, I'm gonna call it Summery Orange Stripe Romper. And then in the description, it's in great condition. Category, this is a romper. Size, size small. Brand. Beach Gold Bali, color orange white. Original price was 120, I'm gonna list this for 30. And if you wanna use Poshmark to buy your favorite brands at super discounted prices, you can do that as well. So I just made a listing and now I'm gonna go through that entire process with all of these items. All right guys, if you don't have the Poshmark app already, you are absolutely blowing it. Go click on the link in my description box to download the app where you can shop my closet as well as all of your favorite brands. I'm pretty excited to reveal to you all my hard work. Dun, dun, dun. Here is the after. It still kind of bothers me that all of my hangers are different colors and textures. I just like how it's not so stuffy anymore. So it's definitely gonna make picking out my outfits a lot better. Ta-da! Everything is neatly folded and organized based on category. So when you open up the closet, you just feel refreshed rather than stressed out when you're picking out an outfit. So I'm pretty happy with what I've accomplished today. It was definitely a lot of work, but very worth it. All right guys, that is it for this video. I actually had a lot of fun organizing and going through my closet. Definitely gave me more of an appreciation of the things that I own already. Don't forget to download the Poshmark app so that you can buy all of the really nice items that I'm listing on there. It is such a great side hustle to make a little bit extra money while organizing and cleaning out your things. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next video.